before ni okoke wacha ni kwambie nikiwa kole mm. you can pare you have to pare at my second year mm. then i gave my life to christ na the interesting story ya mm. hii mbokovu mm. wangu mm. is that the mm. person who led me to christ mm. is the now the father of my three ah, children yeye alisecure future yake na watoto wake man I see you has been good and today your service was awesome mine was lovely i thank god the lord has been so good to us the lord has been so faithful to us and i believe if you're there and you want to give up please don't give up god has a great plan for you the bible says he has great great hey, he has great plans for us plans to fulfill us to give us a future and a hope So we are here on the music stories. Today we have a beautiful lovely guest. Yani she is blessed. I believe you're going to be blessed. You're going to be encouraged. So keep it locked here on the music stories on Wema TV. Karibuni. Nimefika nje ya panda. Ya maisha. Siwe mbali na mibonda. Maana mambo yanilemea. Na safari imekuwa nzito Eh bwana ninakata tamaa majaribu ni mengi vikwazo ni vingi Eh bwana ninakata tamaa usikate tamaa Kwa maana unayojua ni leo ya kesho ni fumbo usikate tamaa <laughs> so hii ndio kusema sisi ni wa maker joyful so, ni, mm-hmm. noise mm-hmm. unto the lord hii ni wa sing unto the lord and all of us are useful to the kingdom karibu sana kwa music stories asante sana eh hey, hapa wema tv tumekusubiria mm, i'm humbled <laughs> i'm humbled sana. kabisa mm-hmm. asante sana kwa for having me mm. it's an honor i don't wow. take it for granted we thank god yes so introduce yourself to our viewers kuna wale wanakuona tu wanaona smile wanafikiria maybe umetoka south africa waambie um. <laughs> my name my, my beautiful name is masisi mm-hmm. um, i'm born again i love jesus i'm a mother of three and a wife mm-hmm. and a minister of the gospel Mm-hmm. Yes. A mother of how many? Three. Ah, me thought ndo me maliza high school. A mother of three, two uh-huh. beautiful girls uh-huh. and one handsome boy. Mm-hmm. Yes. Ah, lovely. So umetoka mtaa gani hii Kenya? Ah, uh, pale mbapo nilizaliwa yes. ama pale ambapo naishi sasa hivi? Tuelezee yote. Oh. Ndio <laughs> tuki. <laughs> Ili tukiulizwe masi ni nani okay. tunaweza tukaeleze. Mimi ni mzaliwa wa in a, I was born in a very small village. Mm. Yes, baby nimezaliwa in the I'm born and brought up. Yaani nimezaliwa na nikalelewa in the village. Ah, yaani mtoto wa Ushago. Mtoto wa village, I'm a village girl. Yes. So, I'm born and brought up in a small village called Ahero. Mhm. Well, I was born in Awasi. It's a very small village. I don't know if you know it. Awasi, yeah. Uko kwenye kuna limango mchele. No, Ahero ndio kuna limango mchele. Now that is where my home is, eh. Lakini sasa where my mama alikuwa na work ni Awasi. Uh-huh. So I'm born and brought up there. Yeah. And in fact, let me say mimi ni mtu nimesoma primary, secondary, mm. uko. Ushago. Uko. 
how was it growing up in the village life in kuade um in the village is just village mm. um but mimi nilizaliwa na walimu wawili ah wani mtoto wa teachers mimi mtoto wa teachers so unaelewa mambo ya teachers kiboko huwa inakuwa anga tu hapa kwa fuko wezi misbehave so um a lot of discipline mm-hmm. a lot of kuchapwa mm. masomo unalazimisha hata kama uelewi kitu darasani lakini lazima mm. lazima usome so wewe kuna vitu i'm sure you never went through kama nini because wewe ni mtoto wa teacher <laughs> wewe uko hiyo ombwa ya ile kitabu ya can i see you outside gani uko <laughs> ile kachali kanakuja kanakwambia can i see you outside we discipline <laughs> ilikuwa juu <laughs> Yes, kwa sababu kiboko mm. eh si tulikuwa tunachapwa. Mm. Eh. What are the challenges you ever went through maybe growing up in the village? Well, um wacha niseme tu exposure. Mm. In fact, one of my major challenge ilikuwa mm. mimi nilirudia class like a whole year. Huh? Na sio kwa sababu ya kwa sababu ya language barrier. <laughs> Nilisoma polling station mm. iso shule, you know the school there. Yes, yes. It's a government school. Mm. Lakini sasa unajua in the village mm. unafundishwa na in luo we are taught in, in luo kama ni mathematics in luo 1 plus 1 in luo iseme in luo iseme in luo tutai tutai interpretia mabazi so in luo they say a chiel kiri wa chiel you know a real so it was just that is mathematics and you know the papers are set in english oh so you jesus. so there was a lot of language barrier mm. so nikafika a point let me say wakati nilifika class 4 my parents decided to take me to a boarding school yes uh, i don't know why they decided to take me to a boarding school mm. but you know i'm a first born yeah, oh. so maybe i was giving room for yeah, well, yeah for others you know, others, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yes. you know. so my parents were liamo kunipeleka boarding, boarding school. school yes wakati nilifika boarding school hakuna kiswahili word i knew oh jesus i did not know any any english word Ah uh, no. Yes. So how and, did you operate? And the f- that's part of the story the boarding school ilikuwa kisi. So hakuna mjaluo huko. Oh Jesus. I'm the only luo mm. and I'm speaking luo. Mm. Na nimepelekwa kisi. Na nimepelekwa kisi. Oh Jesus. Na wanaongea Kiswahili na Kizungu and mm. I am not understanding anything. Mm-hmm. So tulikuwa tunatumia a lot of sign language. <laughs> Hawa wanaongea kikisiwa wanaongea kiswahili kijaluo. No, walikuwa wanaongea na jet subordings, so yeah. kizungu na, na kiswahili. kiswahili. Na mimi sijui hata moja. Sasa hivi ulifika si wendo ulikuwa kwanza kupewa disk. Hey. Ilikuwa zile hata mimi hata sikuwa napewa disk. Sasa unapewa hata uko beyond repair. Yangu ilikuwa serious. And how how did you maneuver? How did you survive? For how long? So I took a whole year mm. learning language. Oh jee. Because hakuna kitu nilikuwa naelewa class. Uli repeat not because hauko unashika masomo. Mm-hmm. Because hakuna I, 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 kitu nilikuwa naelewa class. Mwalimu yeah. anaongea kwa Kiswahili na mimi mm. hajotu kijaka. Wewe unaona nikao na speak in tongue. So that was the only language I knew so. Yes. I repeated a whole I repeated I, I took a whole year nikisoma Kiswahili mm. na Kizungu. Na wengi sasa hivi natutandikia Kiswahili iko sawa. Ni tukufu kwa. You even singing in Najua Biblia nasema kwamba utapitia moto lakini hautanuka nini? Hautanuka moto. Sadaka tuweke wapi mtumishi. So, aya, after sasa umesoma. Mhm. Ndio you must ulijipataje kwenye kwa, muziki? Kwa muziki. Mm. Now my mine is a very funny story mm. kwa sababu mimi wana waimbaji wa wengi unasikia wakisema mm. I started singing when I was young. Eh. Mine I was not I I, I didn't I would didn't start singing when I was young. Uh. I didn't know I could sing. Uh. That was all of primary. Uh-huh. Nilikuwa tu unaona unasoma tu, mm. unasoma tu, unajua mm. unasoma tu kwa sababu mwanangu asoma. Mm. Mm. Soma ukuje nyumbani ukiwa na number 1. Uh. So unangangana tu. Uh. Nikaenda high school. Mm. In fact at one point my high school people mm. wanakuangua kwa social media sana wakisema hiyo story. Mm. Au sikuwa ingia hata hizo. Siko hata inge hizo stories za kwa kwanza there's a time I tried to join your choir yeah. nikachujwa nikaambia niko na sauti mbaya <laughs> nilichujwa wana kusikia ngo kimba sahi yeah huyo uh, mwenye alikwambia uko na sauti mbaya amekutana na mbwa mwalimu usijali ehe mwalimu usijali so mwali my brother that music teacher is is a fan akana kwanga facebook hi teacher <laughs> <laughs> have you seen her latest song? Anywho, moving on swiftly. 
So nilichujwa by then nilichujwa from nini from choir mm -hmm. is all music whatever yeah. nilichujwa zote because like of, they wrote you off yeah alikuwa ananiambia ai wewe unajua ile wana wanachagua watu mm. so mimi nilikuwa namba eh wewe huwezi but unajua pia mm. inaweza kuwa because when i went to secondary mm. um ile high school nilikuwa mm. ilikuwa na madimu wamechanuka mm. na wale washamba na mi by the way nilikuwa kwa ile group ya washamba because i was coming from the village <laughs> i was shaving my hair mm. you know and uh, yeah i had shaved yani le safi i love <laughs> so in the afternoon ah, in the before afternoon. neno ulikuwa ah, no 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 nilikuwa anga tu nilikuwa anga tu hapo you know Jesus. i was just a, a girl from the Mm -hmm. so many things i never used to understand so those were the factors according to wanadamu yeah i think that those were some of the things because unajua na kuangalia wanasema ai you can't represent the school maybe mm -hmm. some maybe i'm imagining so mm -hmm. so nilikuwa tunatolewa but i loved nilikuwa napenda tu kusikia watu wakiimba kukaa hapo wakiimba mm -hmm. but niliambiwa mimi no so nikatolewa from there mm -hmm. So meaning that so me I knew I couldn't sing. Though mm. tulikuwa tukienda mass because mm. I, we were, I was in a Catholic school yes. and I come from a Catholic background. Mm. I used to sing kwa Catholic. Yes, I used Catholic to sing kwa Catholic. Unajua nini make a joyful noise hawa wana shida. Ah, wana shida. Hey. So nilikuwa tu naimba hata pale kwa kwaya, mm. si kwaya hapo tu. You know we are making a joyful noise hey, hapo. Hapo katikati. Kati. But nimeza Catholic. Unakumbuka gani mambo ya Catholic? <laughs> <laughs> you know that song. That's the song in Nanzi Changa Mass by the way. Mimi na jotu ya sadaka. Na ile ya kupenda chakula. So I used to sing Kokoya yes. ya Catholic. Mm -hmm. That's high school. Yes. Um then I went to college. Mm -hmm. So after after high school mm. then I went to college. So nilienda college flani iko iko voi. Mm. Uh, is a branch. Wewe uko unasoma ama uko unafanya tembea Kenya? Actually I did tourism, only <laughs> tourism. Actually my course was tourism management. Uanze primary awasi. Mhm. Uende ahero. Ndio huyo wewe kisi. Kisi. Sasa tunakushikia. Oh, Boy. by the high school ilikuwa nini Nandi uko almost Nandi Hills. Korugal. <laughs> Korugal si karibu na Nandi. Oh, wow. Your <laughs> life was very interesting. <laughs> <laughs> But it was it was good because at least you see I interacted with yeah, different you know yeah. different cultures the exposure that you lacked at yeah, least you got Yeah yeah kwa sababu nikikuwa high school mazee tuko na kunyonga mursi kwanza kulikuwa na wasichana wengine hapo mm. walikuwa anga walikuwa anga bedsi wangu eh. walikuwa analetoa mursi kwa nini mtungi eh. mm? So we used to drink that. So well, we enjoy wakale wakale si wachoyo. Ah, very good people. Very good people. Yes. Mm -hmm. So we used to drink more sick. So mm -hmm. at least I, I I was able to interact with different yeah. cultures. I was in Kisi mm -hmm. kind of, mm -hmm. uh, In fact at some point I could speak Kisi. Kisi. Yes, nilikuwa naongea Kisi. No, I went to Kisi when I was very young. Yeah. So ilikuwa rahisi kwangu ku, mm. kushika. <coughs> so mm. after kutoka high school nikaenda college. Nikaenda college. Mm. So going to college nikaenda there's a college iko iko huko Voi inaitwa Savo Savo mm. Packets mm. so tourism sana sana they do tourism mm. and hotel so me study tourism yeah i'm done tourism management mm. so wakati nilienda hiyo college mm. let me say my first year second mm. not the second one mm. oh, okay all this time mm. please don't forget i was not born again Oh, wow. I was not born again. That's the disclaimer. She wasn't born again. I was not born again. Hapa <laughs> I think tunataka kwenda kwa alikuwa anaimba nyimo gani? Mhm. Nilikuwa naimba unyonyezi mali bwana. Eh hizo za kwa. So at my second year mm. then I gave my life to Christ. Wow. So hapo ndo nili niliokoka. Mm. Na the interesting story ya mm. hii ukovu mm. wangu eh. is that the mm. person who led me to Christ mm. Is the now the father of my three ha, children? Laga, da, 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 da. <laughs> yeah, yeah, ali secure future yake na watoto wake. Man, is, see you. Ona nyinyi hapo mnae. Is, mna, is eh? now the the father of my Wow, of that's my three nice. Children. Hey, we salute you sir. Hatuna mm. ubaya. Uh -huh. <laughs> Akakulit to Christ. Yeah, he led me to Christ. Uh -huh. And uh, two years after he proposed. But he led now, you to Christ. And then he led you to himself. Of course now. Nah. Mm. <laughs> this guy. We attracted. Where does he come from? Luyaland, <laughs> Kitale. Ah. Waluya na hatu ringi. <laughs> We are those people. Hence the name Simiyu. Hey. Oh, this is where Simiyu comes from. Yeah, here. you know most people wananiulizanga. Mm. Kwa nini unaitwa Simiyu na, na wewe ni Luo? Ah. Mm. 
mm. now I get or it. most people don't even know I'm Luo. Most people think I'm Luo. Uh, which uh, I'm Luo by marriage. Yeah, you are Luo by default. <laughs> yes. So you must welcome oh, well, to I'm, our land. I, I, I already came. Yeah, Nini, we will bring tea <laughs> after this. So guys. So yeah, so hence the name Simiu. Yes. So um, after that, after giving my life to Christ, mm. that's when I realized you can now I can sing. sing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's now where I'm history ya kuimba sasa ikaja. Mm. So actually how did it even come after now mm. I gave my life to Christ yes. and nikagundua uh, you know I before ni okoke wacha nikwambie nikiwa kole nilikuwa ni pare after pare. So tulikuwa tunaenda kwa pare after pare. Eh you don't look like one mtoto wa teacher pare after pare. I know. But you know now I had the freedom. Kwa sababu najua sasa nikiwa home there was no freedom. So I went to college. Mm. There was a lot of freedom. Mm. Alafu I was doing tourism. Mm. Tourism is fun. Ah, it's a fun yeah, course. Yeah. So it's your course ya it's not a science course in yeah. Uko. Uko Very Uko serious, Uko. you know. We it's a fun course. Mm. So when I was because I was doing that course, you know, mm. we tulikuwa so exposed to so many things. Yeah. So tulikuwa it was a fun. It was fun every day kuna bash mahali tu. Na tulikuwa tuna we you know. Uh, so after giving my life to Christ, mm. you know that life had to stop. Things has to change. Mm. Mm. That life had to stop. Yeah. Na ilikuwa inabidi nibadilishe my lifestyle. Yeah, we change back a friend. And it change everything. But sasa mm. I didn't know what to do. Mm. So kulikuwa na I was in CU. Mm. Na kulikuwa kuna kwanga na practices za kuimba. Yes. The praise and worship. Mm. So because I see kwana place ya kwenda, I could go there. Mm. Kuaskiza tu. Kwa present worship utaki yeah. kuimba lakini No 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 I don't know Una I was form. just attracted to you. <laughs> as, I didn't know what to do. So yeah. I was just going there mm. kukatu hapo mm. as they as they sing. Mm. So ninaka hapo mm. tunawasikiza mm. wakiimba. Mm. Then kido kidogo nikaanza kuwa na interest. Ile present worship leader mm. akaniambia si join. Sasa nikashinda na join ni but siku kata because mm. now anyway I didn't have anything else to do eh. so nika join na people come so many verse ya obedience is better than Atas sacrifice atasikuwa na hiyo verse eh. unajua we so new in salvation eh. bado eh. sijajua vitu mob eh. but I just love things to do with God yeah. and I inapenda tu vitu za Mungu na napenda muziki mm. so nilikuwa naenda ngatu hapo tu mm. naimba uka join present worship uka join present worship <laughs> we are taking a short break i love tuendelee na history ya masi si mi our own will be right back <laughs> asante sana mpenzi mtazamaji kwa kuendelea kutazama music stories wewe ni wa baraka wewe ni wa muhimu sana bila wewe hatuwezi tukawa hapa tunashukuru sana kwa kuendelea kututumia message zako za pongezi za kutu, kutuelekeza tunashukuru sana na Mungu azidi kukutenda wema ukiangalia pale kwenye mitandao mtumishi wa Mungu Alice Kimanzi aliweza kutoa kibao kipya baada ya kukaa kwa muda mrefu bila kuachilia kazi. Dada Yunis Njeri aliweza pia kuachilia kibao. Amekuwa akiachilia vibao kila mwezi live recording. Na kwa mara sasa ya mwisho alisema hichi ndicho kibao cha mwisho chenye amewachilia wiki hii. Inaonekana ya kwamba waimbaji wamekuwa very busy kwa sababu Evelyn Wanjiru pia naye aliwachilia kibao aliweza kufanya live recording miezi michache iliyopita tazama kazi iliyofanyika na ukaweza kutuelezea waona nini ya kwamba waimbaji wa Kenya wameacha kulala na wanawachilia kazi kwa nyingine yani huduma inazidi kupanuka na kukua Kiangalia pale mitandaoni tena kuna mwimbaji ambaye alikuwa ni mtangazaji anaitwa Jofri kwa Temba ameweza kufanya collab na mtanga, na mwimbaji mwingine kutoka Tanzania ambaye anaitwa Komando wa Yesu. Tazama hicho kibao kikaweze kukubariki na kikaweze kukuinua. Na katika bado katika mitandao waimbaji ibuka yani uprising ministers kuna mwimbaji ambaye anaitwa Delight ameweza kutoa wimbo wake wa pili sijui waweza ukasema nini kuhusu hiyo video kwa mtazamo wangu naona video imefanywa vizuri sana ya kwamba video producers wetu wanajituma na wanafanya kazi nzuri hii kazi imeweza kufanywa na GK Asante sana mtazamaji kwa kuendelea kuwa baraka kwetu endelea kubarikiwa kututumia meseji na Mungu akakutende wema Welcome back to the music stories. We have Masi Simiu in the house. She has quite an interesting story. 
Eh, hiyo ni kizungu nimeporomosha. Ah. Mtumishi tuendele. Uko sawa. Eh, nao sasa umejoin mm. present worship. Mm. Uh-huh. So after joining present worship. Yes. Um so unajua ni kwa tu member. Mm. Ni kwa member tu ni kwa hapo tu eh, naimba. Eh. Ata sikwani nimeshika ni nyimbo gani watu wanaimba but unajua ni kwa tu member. Mm. So one day tukiwa see you. Mm. Mimi nikaenda see you and akukuwa na present worship member mwingine alikuwa me amekuja mm-hmm. i was the only member of present worship team mm-hmm. amekuja then i watch and i watch and it was you chair mm-hmm. unajana kwanga facebook sana kwanza devi mm-hmm. devi yes god is watching you <laughs> alifanya ah. nini devi devi <laughs> <laughs> anambia mm-hmm. ah present worship come and lead us in present worship me mm-hmm. alafu na akukwa na present worship alafu masi mm-hmm. you are a member of present worship come <laughs> i'm like ah, How? I don't even know any song. <laughs> you go to present worship. I can say no you you remember eh? this come li- leaders in that thing that you know. <laughs> what did you think? <laughs> <laughs> so you know everybody's looking at me so like ah, go go because yeah, tunakuanga hapo. Eh hey, tunakuonanga hapo you thought people were not watching. So I went. Mm. And I, I can't even remember the song I sang. But mm. it, it was good. We thank God for what <laughs> I did. <laughs> Ukishasikia <laughs> basi <laughs> we thank God. Me I'm not saying anything. We thank God for you know the Bible says a journey of a thousand miles begins with one. Uligonganisha <laughs> worship praise. God. Hata <laughs> unasema hapo unafika kwa vigelegele kwa hizo vilegelege kwa because now you've not you're not used to to see so many people what vilegelege kwa hizo. <laughs> because you know you sing so many people mbele yako <laughs> looking at so concentrated on you. Hivi, alafu wanakuangalia. They're so concentrated yeah, on you like, like this are kuangalia tu hivi. Alafu you are supposed to you know to unachanganyikiwa na words. Oh, Vile gelege kwa Yesu. <laughs> Vile gelege. I that was the day on first day I did. <laughs> I did that vilegelege. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> so vilegelege. Friends, you figure vilegelege as you watch as it starts. Eh? So, mm. that is your first time you introduce vilegelege. <laughs> <laughs> that was my first, you know, the first day I ever sang. Ever you ever stood on yes, the altar. On the altar to sing or even sing, you know. Yeah. Like sing. Hey, you started working on job. <laughs> you started working on job. <laughs> on job. So after that mm. I remember the switch man said hey, you have a nice voice. I said this guy wants to impress me. <laughs> He's not serious. And I'm chocha. I'm chocha. Yeah. But <laughs> t- let me tell you when mm. I got born again yes. because as I told you my husband yeah. is the one who led me to Christ. Actually wow. that time he was not my husband. He, he was we were we were students. Mm. I didn't even know him. Mm. Uh, we were just in the same college. Yes. He alikuwa anafanya course nyingine tofauti. I was doing a different course. In fact different blocks. Mm-hmm. So yeah, alikuwa anafanya tu evangelism tu. Wow. But he knew me of course. Mm-hmm. Nilikuwa anga tu mtu anajulikana I was the student mm-hmm. leader. I was the class representative of my ile class ambayo nilikuwa. So nilikuwa anajulikana kidogo. Kwa hivyo ulianza kwa celeb kitambo is just that. No, but unajua nilikuwa anga tu loud. Nilikuwa anga tu mtu loud to that those days. Yeah. Kuja tu nikatulia baadaye. Hapo tulia. Tulia na wewe. So baadaye. <laughs> but before mm. I was nilikuwa anga tu mtu. Yeah. yeah. Hyper. Yeah, hyper. Yeah, exactly. That's the best word. I was a mm. very hyper person. Yes. Mm-hmm. So he, I was known. Alikuwa mm. ananijua. Yeah. So yeah, he preached Jesus to me. In fact, <laughs> preached Jesus mm. to me Alice but I did not Zuri. I did not get born again the same day yes so when I went for attachment is when I gave my life to to Christ, Christ. when I get when I got born again now mm. yeye ndiye alikuwa mtu wa kwanza kuniambia you have a ministry in you mm. wow yeah that was now when after now coming back to see you akaniambia you uko na kitu you have something in you mm. nikamwambia ai bana Yeah, yeah. Kwa serious. Kuna watu unaambia wako na ministry. Mm. I know everybody will understand you are anaweza kuwa wako na. Haki sasa mimi sure ali you know mm. this is a joke. Kama Moses ukasema minister. Ah that's a joke. Mm. That's a joke. I don't mm. look like it. Mm. So he was the first person to tell me so. Mm. Then the CEO came and tells me, hey, "You have a good voice." I'm like, "Ai. Ajua oh, tu nini ya kuni encourage kwa sababu ya hiyo vilegelege nilione nikama vilegelege because of what I did. <laughs> I thought he was trying to you know encourage me because of <laughs> <laughs> But now it went on like that you know every time nilikuwa naenda naimba mm. one song or two ungesikia you know people are saying oh you, you have something 
until one time now it became a prophecy someone you know prophesied to me I can yes. you have a ministry I can confirm I can confirm mm -hmm. then I joined the church mm. choir mm -hmm. a praise and worship team which church now redeemed gospel church mm. Uruma no 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 mm. I was in Voy oh redeemed gospel church Voy Voy yes nice so nika kwa in fact hapo sasa ndio nseme let me say nili nilikuwa sana kabisa mm. so because i was you, there for years when did you start recording after college that was in 2000 okay mm -hmm. i started recording in 20 2011 oh yes your first ever song yes how was it um i would say by that time now mm -hmm. nilikuwa nishapata nilikuwa nao nishajijua mm -hmm. this is what i'm called to mm -hmm. do mm -hmm. So I had a lot of confidence. Yes. Hata nikienda kwa pulpit kuimba nilikuwa na lot sio kama mara ya kwanza. Nilikuwa na vilegele. Yeah, and sio kama hiyo sio. Sasa unajua bado nilikuwa. So the when now after that now I already know who I am. Mm. I knew I am called to do this. Yes. So somebody introduced me to Billy Frank. Mm. Remember Billy Frank? Yes. Billy Frank is the one who recorded my first song, Asene no Yesu. Wow. You sang in Hebrew. Yeah, in Luo. In how was this you know Luo is very nice. Lou is very nice, but yeah. now that song, mm -hmm. we thank God for that song. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> <laughs> just here, we thank God. I told you guys, when you hear us, you say, we thank God. Uh -huh. That song, mm -hmm. um, it was, I don't know, okay, it was well received by some people, but yeah. some people used to say, Niliweng sana kwa yu imbo. Ah. So, yeah, my fellow, you know. Yeah. My fellow. So, Ibu, we imba mini kusikiza. So, najwa minta kwa mbio kweli, aya, just to a uh, verse. And I just say I'm perfect my luo kwa your song so I'll sing well. I will sing we confirm with I'm the nini judge here. Okay. Ana seneno Yesu asenene imbe kaimanyo Yesu ni yude. Hey. Yo. Ah, you need time. So that is the first song. I did a Luo song being my first song. Your first song was Luo. Mm -hmm. Hey. Mm -hmm. And uh, did the media receive it well? How was it? Well, unajua ukianza kuimba, atujuangi hizi stories ati. Utaweza enda wapi upeleke song wapi kwa media. Ama ukaika kwa nyimbo likuna ambia tu majirani. Ai. But let me tell you, that song, mm -hmm. one thing I appreciate God is, mm -hmm. that song opened doors for me. Yes. Because that song, by the way, my pastor is the one who paid that song for me. At the end, wow. be, it is time go mm. to studio. Wow. So, wakati alinambe, it's time go to studio. Mm. Aka nilipia the first song. Mm. Na nikaenda studio. Mm. And I did the I did the song. So, after kufanya yo song, mm. I came back. And I only had one song. By mm. the way, nilikuwa na performing to song moja. Nikifika maali. Udo the poor mm. knew I could sing. Yeah. Wakana, perform a song. Mm. Ay. And after he performed to Irudie, to Irudie, yeah. because it's only one. So, <laughs> I remember one time. You know the CD, you know the CD, you know the CD, you know the CD, you know the CD. By the way, there's a, there's a guy, mm. hey, may God bless that guy. Mm -hmm. uh, and we had gone for a function, yes. it was a school function. Well, mm. I think they were going to funga shule or something. Mm. Mm. So, I was invited mm. to grace the occasion. And you know, I only had one, mm. one song, hit. one powerful song. One hit song. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. At that time, <laughs> <laughs> so when I went with that song yes. and I was requested to perform the song, that guy was in the meeting. Mm. After that, I can myself for me the CD. It can be a hey, sir, it is only one, one song. song. I, actually, it's going to make a CD. I can remember, yeah, I want that one song. Mm. I said, hey, mm. How much do somebody <laughs> say one song? <laughs> <Tell That's it. laughs> so me, I didn't know, so I just told him, Okay, I'll, I'll let me organize. And so he gave me his number. Mm. So how can I say? Actually, he sent his wife Whoa. to pick the CD. Ah, okay. Well, how the wife is a friend of mine. Okay. Actually, okay. <laughs> I went to the company. Okay. Okay. Yes. Mm. So I, we met. I met with the wife because now the guy had gone to to work. Yes. So I met with the wife. Mm. The wife came with one thousand shillings. For I one got song. one song. I was very happy. I said, "Hey, okay." So I can sell one song at one thousand <laughs> shillings. <laughs> I got enlightened. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so I was I was excited, and, but it opened. It opened doors to other songs mm. because uh, I started going for missions with mm. my mentor. Yes. My mentor used to go for a Who lot is of, your mentor? My mentor is uh, she's Prophetess Lydia. She's wow. Wanjiro. She's not ah. actually in, <laughs> in the country. In the country. Yes. But she's the one who has mentored me Very in nice. music. Mm. Actually from college. Mm. So as we speak, how many albums do you have? Albums. You know, nowadays we do single songs. So, <laughs> so how many well, I have a full album, album mm -hmm. two of them. Mm. 
then now the singles, the ones on YouTube, mm. they're almost now 10 or 15. 10 or 15. Yes. And this journey, you know, there are many people who are thinking about it. Like, when you talk about it, this story is going to be. Yes. What happened? In 20... Well, now I started singing in 2011, mm. remember. That is not singing, mm. recording. Recording, yes. Yes, I started recording in 2011. Mm. And I, we did missions 2011, 2012. We did missions. Mm. 2013, I gave mm. birth to my son. I have yes. a baby who is differently abled. Yes. So, <clears throat> as we were doing ministry, mm. then I gave birth to, to this handsome boy. Yeah. So, when I gave birth to my son, mm. I, I think everything for me... Everything for me, like, I, I, should I say, shut down or what? Crumbled. Yes, it like, Niliona Giza too. Oh. I, you know, I even had, I had long hair. Those days I could do like this, you know. Oh. Then I shaved my hair. <laughs> oh. What happened? You know, I, I, I don't know. Let me say I gave up. Oh. I think the best because thing to say is just I gave up. Yeah. Because yeah. That you felt boy, like Umeko Kimbi That then. boy needed, not even that. Mm. I was not even, bl even blaming God. Mm. But, you know, looking at my son, mm. The boy needed me. Yeah. I even resigned. I was working in a tour farm. Mm. So I resigned. Mm. I, I I stopped ministry. I stopped everything. I stopped Literally, everything. like, I, I, I went back to stay in the, mm. in the house mm. with the boy because he needed me. Mm. So I, I was in the house and I knew, I knew my story. Mm. Uh, so you're a break. You're a break. From 2013 to 2017 is when I came to do another song. Wow. Mm. Which song did you do your 2017? 2017 I did Mwaminifu. Mm. And then I did Usikate Tama. Oh. Yes. Usikate Tama is my song, by the way. It's not us. <laughs> mm? Usikate Tama, mm. it is... Okay, it is our song. Mm. It, I yeah. know it's yours. Well. <laughs> we have a song. So it is yeah. us. Mm. <laughs> because uh, I had given up. Yes. I did not know mm. I will ever sing again. Mm. So, at that time, what happened? Um, mm. I met somebody. I met mm. a certain lady. I'd gone, in fact, for the first time, I'd come out of my house to go to town to buy yes. tomatoes, you know. Yes. So, when I was coming back, I met a certain lady. Mm. She was telling me how she had given. By the way, mm. my husband was a pastor. Yes. He was an associate pastor. Mm. So, we were pastoring in a certain church. Yes. Then, we moved from that church to yes. another church. Mm. So this lady was looking for my husband. Mm. Then she met me. Then she was like, mm. where did pastor go? Mm. I said, ah, we're just there. Mm. Two we're just two. there. Two two. Mm. Then she's like, hey, I have a problem. I want you to pray for me. You know, she's telling me to pray for her. Yeah. And you and yourself, you need the prayers. I need prayers. <laughs> you know, I need prayers. <laughs> yes, yes. I can't pray for someone, mm. but she wants me to pray for her. Yes. So that now that's time. Mm. And God gave me her word. Whoa. Yeah, mm. God gave me a word. That word that uh, about Joseph, mm. he was a prisoner, you know, mm. and then he woke up mm. as a prime mm. minister. So she was telling me the business was not doing fine. Mm. So you know, when I, when God gave me her word, mm. and God told me to tell her not to give up because what she knows is today. Mm. She doesn't tomorrow know about tomorrow. Tomorrow is a mystery. Mm. Yeah, tomorrow is a mystery. God yes. can do anything. Anything. Like twinkle God can overnight. change the story. Yes. So that is how you came back with the word. So when, when I gave, when I, you know, mm. as I was talking to her mm. about that scripture mm. and telling her about, you know, you know, talking to her about it. Mm. Then when we left one another, I started thinking about what I was telling her. You, Kumbe, you needed it more. Yes, now I started, you know, I was in the car, I was meditating. I'm just meditating upon that word. Mm. And it was ministering to me. Mm. I know it was not my word, mm. but... <laughs> <laughs> but it was your word and her word. word. And I don't know. Word. I don't know. It yeah. was yeah. It was, mm. but it was ministering to me powerfully. And when I came to the house, it is word that I meditated on. Uh, like three days, I was meditating upon mm. just that word. Mm. That is how I came up with that song. Oh, usikate tama. Yes. Unajua ni leo. Ya kesho ni fumbo. So there is uh, maybe. Do you have mentors? Mentors. Mentees. Sorry, mentees. Where mm. we mentor? Okay. The, well, oh, the kuna watu who... unalea. Yeah. Mm. Uh, kuna watu ninalea. Wangapi. And how is it? Entering. Mm. Ni, so far, mm. I have, uh, okay, right now as we're mm. talking, mm. I have about three people. Yes. And mentoring people, it is not easy. Mm. Of course, because, you know, mentoring someone mm. means you have to correct mm. them. 
and people don't like being corrected mm. many a times mm. the people will come to you thinking they're very perfect yeah they love you to mentor them yes. but they don't want you to mentor them mm. <laughs> they love but they don't want they don't want it yeah they're not really you know people, people somebody will come to you tell you i want you to mentor me mm. without knowing what it really means mm. to mentor someone mm. they are not ready to be corrected they mm. don't want to because mentoring someone means you'll tell them ah mm. You, you should not do this mm. you should do this mm. when you're doing this you don't do this when mm. you're doing this, don't go here mm. go here you know mm. but people most of the time mm. don't like being told what they're supposed to do mm. so that is where the challenge is yes yeah so how do you get your songs okay lala okay tembe ama ukipika mimi napata anga songs nikipika by the way amen <laughs> Whoa, you, should, you should cook a lot <laughs> now <laughs> please cook even when you finish it yeah. go cook. cook again yes so, <laughs> so me Uh, um most of the time uh, i get my songs when i'm very just quiet you mm. know just most of the time meditating mm. and just quiet mm. yeah so i like being somewhere in my quiet mother. alone mm. with god mm. Mm. maybe there is an artist out there maybe they have a special baby like your your very own mm. and they have given up mm. or there is just a woman somewhere who has given up on life mm. kindly encourage them and just tell them something Well, mm. this one is to my you know I call them I call them almasi. I call them royal ladies. Mm. Um I'll I'll tell you for free. Mm. Having a baby who is differently able it mm. is not easy. Mm. It is something that really needs a lot of grace. Yes. Almost, many, many times I meet people and they tell me, "Masi, you're strong." Mm. I am not strong. Mm. 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 I am not. It mm. is just the grace of god mm, mm. <laughs> that covers me every day yes and i would like to just encourage someone mm. today mm. there's that song that i sang about mm. about you know my son mm. and i'm saying god is the answer mm. many times you have so many uh, so many questions mm. personally mm. i do get i do you know the other day i was telling someone you know mm. sometimes i cry mm. and they were like you okay <laughs> kulia yeah I know I don't look like I can cry but sometimes mm. I do. Mm. I go to especially when I don't have a house. Mm. So you know like the reality hits me and it hits me badly. Mm. And in fact I said this year mm. I'll begin to talk about it mm. because that also keeping quiet about it mm. is very very dangerous mm. and you begin to realize I'm mm. sinking into depression. into depression. Yes. So I said this year I'll begin to talk about you mm. know mm. about it so yeah. that you know hey, let me share it to you even if you don't want to hear it. Yeah. Yeah, you guys will have to hear it by force. We are listening. <laughs> <laughs> by force by fire. By force by fire. Mm. Yeah, so to the mothers who are who are to, uh, I call them special mothers. Yes. Uh mothers with children like mine. Mm. You know, just hold on God. Mm. There is nothing else. Mm. God is the answer. Mm. When you begin to wonder how will I get money for therapy? Mm. How will I get umtoto atawaitembea? Like mm. my my son is turning nine mm. and he's not walking yet. Uh, you begin to wonder you begin to ask yourself so many questions mm. you get people family members mm. coming to tell you things mm. ai kwani wewe mm? mm. you get friends you get yes. people who even some of them are born again but yeah. you know they tell you stuff mm. god is the only person you can always hold on to na hata kuacha you know he will always come through mm. any time every mm. time mm. yes whoa And as we finish with Masi see me you we will finish with one of her songs. I forgot to say I have a song that is coming. And I have not forgotten she has a new song. Yes. Loading. She's yes. gonna on Jesha we. She's oh, on Jesha as. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, uh, guys thank you for your support. If you want to market your products with us we have our page on Twitter. Instagram, Facebook, Wema TV or you want someone to help with your music, you can inbox me on my Facebook page Maggie Joy Blessings. Maybe you're there, you're an artist, you would want someone to help you to distribute your music. I'm here. I'm going to help you uh, not free, not free of charge, but I'm going to help you and I'm going to join with you. And uh, if you're there, you're an artist, please sing unto the Lord. Usiimbe kuhusu mashida zako. Usiimbe kuhusu wale walikukosea. Eh unawaitishia moto, unawaitishia sijui nini. Ah uh-uh. ah. Penda tu Mungu. Just tell God how good he is, how faithful he's been. Tell God about his faithfulness. Usianze kushitaki watu kwa Mungu. Ah uh-uh. you, ah. You are not the accuser of brethren. Eh, hey, bwana sana. Leo ni siku today. 
Thank you for watching Music Stories and we are finishing with Masisimi. Masisimi ujatuma salamu. Oh, hey. ala. <laughs> no, wazi wazi wa sabu kurai. Sisi kama wa ingo. Uko na list tu hapa. Sisi kama watu wa watu wa Western. Tunataka kutuma salamu. Tuende. Naanza kwanza na yule Western mkufu kwa nyumba yangu my husband. Masi ya kwangi hivi ni nja. Mr. Moses me I salute you so much my husband and be watching Wema TV. <laughs> Where you are? Eh? Uh, Watch Wema TV. Yes. Mm, yes. And my my children. Hi. Mm. Alafu najua ninakwanga na wase wengi. Mm. Wale mabishti zangu ni wengi sisi tuseme hiyo list yote. Mm. Na unajua kutuma salamu ni weakness. What So my friends, mm. I love you so much. Thank you so much for the support for everyone who loves my ministry. Mm. God bless you so much for always supporting me every time mm. I have a new song. And of course a new song is coming. Because yeah. this time I've done a different thing. It's mm. a worship song. Yes. That is your kawaida yangu. Yeah. So I have a worship song and mm. I know God is going to bless us together. Wakikutaka wakupate wapi on Twitter, Facebook. Kama jina yangu inaitwa Masisimiu. Ko Facebook Masisimiu. Mhm. YouTube Masisimi Masisimi Instagram Masisimi Masisimi underscore music Mpesa Twitter Twitter <laughs> oh, sorry I'm on Twitter Twitter Simi Masis- yes, sorry <laughs> <laughs> Masisimi music uh-huh. Yeah thank you so much Thank you for coming to Wema TV yeah, This boy. has been your music series I'm your girl Maggie Joy Blessings Ciao Inyo